Well, police say the man and woman were inside the truck when the shooting happened. And out here, you can see this is where the truck hit the fence. There's broken glass on the ground. And then the truck hit the corner of this building, according to the owner of a business here, who says he received an early morning phone call from investigators. As soon as we get wake up from the police, we start reviewing. Reviewing what his new surveillance camera captured. Fanis Gonez installed it after his business was vandalized twice. When officers asked him to check his footage today, he found this. We can see the police's activity here from all angles of the camera. Tiffany saw the activity too. Yeah, I had just woken up to check on my trailer in my car. She says she was staying across the parking lot at the Best Western. All of a sudden I heard um, gunshots and a large, you know, boom. Soon the sound of sirens followed. Police say they arrived around 2.30 a.m. A man had called 911 to report that he fired his gun after confronting a man and a woman who were allegedly stealing his truck from the hotel's parking lot. He's on scene with her unconscious male. Officers found the man slumped over in the driver's seat. Here we got a female, two GSWs. And the woman sitting outside the truck with apparent gunshot wounds, according to police, who say the truck's owner is being cooperative and his loaded firearm is now evidence as detectives investigate the fatal shooting. When it comes to auto thefts, a recent report from the National Crime Insurance Bureau found Washington ranks third in the nation, with the vehicle theft rate rising by 31 percent in three years' time. So my geez. Smarties. As for what happened here, a life lost because of this. Those close to today's crime scene say it's a wake-up call. In this particular area, I know it's getting worse in certain areas, but I was really surprised here. You don't expect it here and it will happen, but it's happening. Now, police say a car stolen out of Burien was also found in this lot, and that is connected. That's part of the investigation for detectives who are still collecting evidence, and that evidence will be reviewed by the prosecutor. Live in Linwood, Natalie Swaby, King 5 News.